Hi, I'm Sean with the DaneCountyMarket.com real estate team here at Keller Williams Realty. Welcome back to our video blog. Today we're going to be talking about some potentially unexpected costs of buying a property that you may not have factored in. So some costs you may have not have factored in. Everybody knows they have to make a down payment in most loan products and uh, there's a few other associated costs. So. We want to make sure that you're prepared for these. Um, as always, we're here to help walk you through these so they aren't expected things while we meet for your consultation before we go look at properties. The first one is the cost of the inspection itself. So an, an inspection is pretty necessary on a property just to make sure there aren't any hidden things wrong with the property. So an inspection typically costs a few hundred dollars, 400 to 500 is a good planning range to get a good inspector. Another Closely associated thing would be any testing that you want to do. Radon gas testing, that typically can add between $100 to $150 to the inspection. So a second thing would be bringing extra cash to the table um, that your lender might require. We already know that you're going to put X amount down, 5%, 10%, 20%. Um, but a lot of lenders require you to escrow your taxes. So that means they may require you to put a year's taxes in escrow um, and hold on to them or a part of the year's taxes in escrow. They may cause you, cause you to have to prepay your insurance for the year as well. Um, and they may charge origination fees. There's going to be a, uh, a fee for your appraisal if it's necessary. A third item would be the cost of the move itself. So you've closed on your property and now you got to get all your stuff to it. Unless you've got a bunch of buddies willing to help for cheap, this may cost you thousands of dollars to hire a moving company to, to relocate everything with the white glove service at least. And finally, um, as a new homeowner, there's going to be some just ongoing things that kind of sneak up and grab you that you need to pay for, ongoing routine things. Your furnace filter needs to be changed. Your fireplace, if you have it, should be inspected yearly, as well as your furnace heating and air conditioning system. Um, and inevitably, something's going to break and if, if you're moving from the rental world, now it's your responsibility as a homeowner. Congratulations. As a new homeowner, you may want to consider either purchasing or asking the seller to purchase for you a home warranty, which would give you at least a, a year of coverage. If any of this doesn't make sense or you have further questions, please reach out to us. We're happy to sit down and, and do a consultation with you and help explain how this all works. Thanks for watching our video. We're here to guide you through the entire process and answer any questions that you might have. So we hope that you'll reach out to us. Thanks for watching the video and we will see you next time.